What's up, guys? I think we're live. Uh, so we're back in it today with some Valheim. It's kind of the game of the month. Actually, I mean, game of uh, game of right now. It's made it past its first month, and I like to see when uh, new games like this, especially when they're the type of game that I already like playing, you know, do well. Alrighty, and uh, I did a couple things off screen because you know I'm just dedicated like that. So, uh, first things first is I went ahead and expanded the shit hut. As you can see, I put a proper roof on it, expanded it out just a bit. We're not going to be living here super long, but uh, another thing too is I just gathered up a whole bunch of resources. What's up, Skrits? And uh, yeah, I didn't really have a lot of room, even with all these chests inside. So, I guess you can just make wood piles. So each one of these is just 50 wood stacked up. I assume later on we'll be able to... Destroy them? Yeah, for 50 wood. Cool. Throw that back on there. Honestly, it just it just kind of looks cool. I'm not sure how practical this is, but if the uh, if the aesthetics are, are good, I'm, I'm gonna go with it. I think everyone knows aesthetics are more important than actually being useful. And then I went ahead and also set all of this back up because we actually have metal now, which is exciting. No longer are we just wood wheeling barbarians. We have tin and copper, which means we can make bronze. So, you know, pretty legit. You got to kind of keep up on it, which is annoying. Uh, you can only put and or in and you can put 20 coal in but it goes through the coal faster so you tease what you tease i did a bit of work on this road which is pointless but yet again hashtag aesthetics and really the biggest thing is now that we have the pickaxe is i was able to come over here and we had a copper node right here um i kind of went ham and just Smashed it all out. Okay. We have friends. MLG plays. That's what I'm talking about. Okay. Three for three. Can't say I'm not consistent. Alright. So, yeah. Copper. We dug all that out. I ran down to the coast. And that's where you grab the tin. Now, like I had said last time, this is kind of the starting area over here. And then this is the dark forest. And I believe once you get past the dark forest, there's another clearing. And we should be able to set up an actual base there. So we've pretty much already dunked all over this whole place, beat the boss. I don't know. I marked a whole bunch of stuff. I have no clue what any of this is. Oh, okay. Uh, rude. I was looking at a map. Also, I was able to kill a troll, which was pretty sweet. Because that means we can make, I think, one more piece of gear. Although now we can make metal. So, I don't know. It might be worth holding off on that. Also... I don't know how exactly. I don't know if it's because I was fighting a bunch of bad guys late at night and uh, they came over and were able to break the trees, but we have a bunch of logs that normally we can't cut down. And unfortunately I can't, even as logs, can't chop them up, but that's uh, that's some fine wood. <laughs> how's the uh, how's the audio? Does it sound okay? I, uh... Tried to optimize it to sound a little bit better this stream. Okay, so I did a little bit of research. And I believe we can now do a thing. Some kind of thing. Is it a different workbench? The forge. Okay, so we just need uh, a little bit of wood. A little bit of coal. I got that. How much you want? I got it. I don't got it. I've apparently used all my coal. Helmet looks kind of lame. It's kind of like a like a bonnet. Not sure I really want to do that. Yet again, aesthetics, you know. Just gotta have it. 
You're not looking good. You're not feeling good. You're not playing good. You know, a lot of people overlook that. Give me some pants. Hell yeah. Uh, we look exactly the same, just a slight tint of blue. Spend all this time and resources, you know, really upgrading your gear. And uh, now you're a tint of a different color. So I think we're going to have to add upgrades and stuff. So I'm going to try to leave some room to do that. Oh, look at that. So we got bronze, a knife, something, something. I don't know. It's going pretty quick. I mean, I guess let's just make a piece of bronze. See what that uh, what that does for us. Okay, more armor, nails. Oh, dude, we're getting oh all this stuff: a sword, a spear. This guy's out here just whacking on my beehive. Get the fuck out of here, bro. Uh, yeah, so I was able to farm up just a ton of, I mean, I don't know if this is a ton in the grand scheme of things. Basically, uh, we want to build a cart because we're, we're packing all this up and, uh, shipping off. Uh, I should probably go explore first and find a good place, but you know, that requires thought, not really, uh, something I believe in. You know, maybe we could just jump straight to the, uh, the bronze helmet with eight armor. I don't need much of the skin, just a bit. We will grab the helmet. Ooh, you're shiny. Boom. So what are we working with here? Uh, there's some kind of weight limit. So, uh, I don't know. Give me, give me some heavy stuff. I'll just kind of moat my way over there. Okay. So that is 300 weight. So are we still... Not in the right... Oh, okay. I'm, I'm doing it. Okay, and it doesn't affect our weight. I mean, so that's pretty cool. Okay, let's, uh, you know, let's, uh, let's just start loading up here. Okay, we're at 500. It seems fine. Okay, let's go uh, ransack the place for some valuables. Hey, uh, you know, any donations are, are greatly appreciated, uh, even of the stiff wooden variety. Uh, you know, a little poplar, you know, maybe a little oak. And you got some maple, you know, maybe you're from Canada. You know, you got them, uh, them big maple trees. We don't discriminate. I mean, maybe I just smelt everything possible down into bronze so it takes up less room oh also I'm, I'm quite proud of this probably shouldn't be but uh while i was making the wood stockpiles i also went ahead and made stone stockpiles and instead of just you know fluttering up the base because they don't stack very nicely like the wood ones did i went ahead and put them at the base of the uh our ghetto little beehives and, uh, I don't know, I think it kind of gives some more realism to the whole mailbox kind of thing we got going on. It'll give us, okay, that'll give us enough for, I think, six pieces of bronze. I've been, uh, I've been rocking this spear a little bit. And that's six bronze, okay. Here's our bronze. Look at that, bronze spear. Hell yeah, brother. Now, holy cow, okay, so that has almost 1,200 weight. And that doesn't affect me at all, does it? No, okay, so you know what? I am going to load myself up as well. Sure, all right, you know what? Let's, let's get the show on the road. Now, something to be aware of is the cart can take damage, so... Pretty much, if someone rolls up on us, we're going to have to drop the cart and uh, just kind of make a run for it. Might be, might be a little slow going. 
Oh, you also can't uh, pan around your your view. <laughs> you can sneak with the cart. Uh, okay. Yeah, sure. Why not? I'd be interested to see if the cart actually makes noise for creatures. Or if you can still just sneak up on them. Well, that guy saw us. Drop the cart. Nice. 32 damage. Yeah, it's about a 50% increase, I'd say. Now, going through here is going to be a little, uh, little sketch. Because, like I said, last time I was out... Okay, we're already stuck. So that's excellent. Uh, last time I was out, kind of just mining up some stuff. Dude, are you kidding me? Oh, we're hitting the cart. Okay, we're free. Uh, I think it was down here somewhere there was actually a troll uh yeah yeah, yeah. he kind of looked like that he was large and blue and uh quite mean looking he was a real stupid thing though would hate to come across one of those i'm completely out of arrows i have miscalculated uh I'm not sure this spear is going to be strong enough to take this guy. Oh, yeah, spear throw only does that much to him. Hmm. Well, I mean, I guess I should have known that there's going to be a troll. As long as he doesn't follow us all the way back to the house and or find our cart. Actually, that's fine. If I can get him to stop out in this field... I will light him up. Yeah, yeah. I think we're going to go for the Atomic Wedgie Strat. He's kind of like a big bully. So you just want to go for the, the low blows. Um, let me see if I can prep the pocket sand. Somewhere. Ah, here we go. Now, I don't know when if you lead them away from their patrol path. Is he just chilling here? Or did he go back? Fairly large, so I don't think he's... Hiding behind a bush or anything. Oh, there he is. Oh, dude, he's totally wrecking our cart. No. What are you doing? Yeah, dumbass. Oh, out of stamina. Okay. I am apparently the dumbass. I'm stuck in a hole of my own design, literally. Okay. I'm going to disrespect him by eating in the middle of uh, Mortal Kombat. Okay, little guy. Dude, I swear, these trolls are harder than the first bosses. Like, no joke. Okay, especially when you can't hit any shots. That doesn't help. Okay, he's de Like an idiot. Ooh, that was right in the face. Smile. There we go. No, hopefully he didn't destroy our cart and now it is night time or about to be okay um in a panic i may have forgotten where our cart was Ooh, okay good no we we got it we're good this guy's uh definitely getting leg day in let's say that oh sh okay we're good. Is there health on this? Thing? Okay, apparently the bronze spear does not improve your aim. That appears to be a fault of my own. Downtown? Nice. The driving's a bit rough. You see, I, I think part of the issue is I'm not actually holding the cart. Uh, it's just kind of a small rope tied around my waist you uh you don't want to know what i'm steering with let's just say that i gotta keep my hands free i'm really not too sure how i feel about being out in the woods although honestly these bushes have given us a harder time than anything else Ooh, a shaman okay i lost my spear okay Throw that away. 
Drop the one stone. Give me the trophy. Oh, wow. Okay. We are super full on stuff. Let's grab the spear. Did I get it? No, I don't want the one rock. Give me my spear. Okay, there you go. Oh my lord. Come on. Come on. Gotta give it the juice. Now, I'm gonna feel like an idiot if at the end of all of this, it turns out we're heading the wrong direction. wonder if I could just nuke it down from here. Okay. Whiff. There we go. That's a hit. Oh, look at them running around like idiots. They have no clue what's going on. Okay. If I could hit the inanimate object, that'd be great. Oh, hell yeah. There you go. How do you like your spawner now? What I've been able to tell is I don't think stuff despawns really. So that means once we get all set up with our new base and stuff, we should be able to just run back through the forest and duck all this stuff up. Oh my god. Okay, this guy's pretty big. Okay, and yet again, every time I throw my spear, we pick something else up instead. Uh, yet again, completely full. Hopefully we have some room in the cart for some of this stuff. Now, we need to find our spear. We need to find this spear and also not pick up a bunch of useless crap. Oh, okay. Mm. Okay. Yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm not going to read this. I, I think reading is overrated. Where the hell is our cart? The spawner was kind of the point of reference I was using. Oh, there we go. Then I destroyed it. Now let's roll out transformers. All right, so I mean, eventually the uh, the idea is that the black forest will kind of let up and take us. Oh, Jesus Christ! Come on, uh, it'll let up and uh okay well i guess we're fighting these guys holy cow okay there's a couple of them a two for one shish kebab special yeah we're definitely gonna have to run back through here because there's just loot for days where'd we uh where'd we leave the cart Kinda wish there was a cart icon on the mini-map, or something. The, the cart's like right down here, right? I am apparently dumb, or blind, I mean, some combination of the two, perhaps. Alright, chat, I'm back. Did you find my cart? No, you guys didn't find- okay. Well, you know, I step away for two seconds, I asked you guys to find the cart. Were you even looking, you know? Like, oh my, it's right there. Oh my God, see, guys, what? I gotta do your job for you. You guys were all freaking out that I lost it and you weren't even looking. Uh, this kind of looks like the Black Forest just continues forever. Okay, drop, drop the cart. Okay, that's a big guy. Dude, leave the cart alone. Nice. But I'd really prefer not to be fighting these guys. That would be ideal. Am I poisoned? What is it? Oh, okay, yeah, poison. Oh, they're just gonna keep spawning. Oh no. Okay, this has started to go terribly for us. Holy cow. Alright, we, we gotta start taking these shamans out, otherwise we are posed. Oh, run, 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 run. Wow, the shamans heal for uh, quite, quite a quite a bit. Oh, you know what? The uh, the big one de aggroed on us, so that's that's good. I feel like now I might be able to start taking on the shaman. Oh, stop healing, dude. Can you just, like, die? Ooh. 
Okay, that, uh, that was another tough one. Wow. All right. And, uh, chat, you were keeping track of where we left the cart, right? Right? That was your, uh, that was your one job? You know, I, uh, I fought off the giant horde of, uh, you know, goblins, you know, risking my life. And, uh, you keep track of the cart? Uh, where's the cart? You panicked. You panicked again. You dropped the cart. And then, uh, and then you left it. Yeah. This car just keeps dragging us back. Okay. So one issue with trying to cut through the forest this way is going to be... I think it's all hills. So the long journey just became that much longer. 